Well, happy 2022 to you. That's almost hard to say. Hope you had a great holiday season and um, are looking forward to a, um, a new year with hopefully um, improved uh, things going on in our lives with COVID and all that other stuff. In terms of real estate, um, I'm thinking that we might be in, in store for another kind of crazy year, um, but I thought I'd give you a quick recap on the sales that happened in 2021 and um, by, by various communities, and I'll do homes and villas real quickly, and then give you a flavor for what the current inventory level is, because there's a big um, gap, discrepancy, shortfall, call it what you will. But um, the numbers are interesting, um, and I think what it will tell you is that, first of all, if you are a homeowner, property owner uh, on island, or in the whole area for that matter, and you're thinking about selling, then we need to talk because it's still a great time to sell. And if you're ready to buy, which many folks are right now, um, then we just need to work really, really closely together so that we can get that, um, get that accomplished for you. So uh, I'm gonna to refer to a list that I made here, but for example, in 2021, Sea Pines had 30, 333 home sales and the current inventory is 10. We had 154 villa sales and the current inventory is seven. Uh, Forest Beach, I'm gonna just kind of go through the different communities on islands, had 60 home sales, current inventory is seven. They had 351 villas sales in 2021 and they are currently 20 for sale. Shipyard doesn't have a lot of homes, but they had 13 home sales, which is high, and there's one available for sale right now. There were 114 villas and there's one villa available. Long Cove, uh, which is a, um, is a community where you don't have any short-term rentals, but they had 53 homes sold and there's four listed for sale right now. In Palmetto Dunes, there were 112 homes sold and there are 10 listed for sale. And they had 259 villas sale and there are seven listed today. In Port Royal on the north end of the island, um, 51 homes sold and there are four listed for sale and 18 villas sold and there's one listed for sale. Hilton Head Plantation, which is a big, um, big community, a lot of single family residents had 243 homes sell and there are 15 listed for sale. And likewise, they had 19 villas and three are listed for sale. Indigo Run, which is an interior community, had 67 homes sell and there are three listed for sale and they had one villa sell and there aren't any other listings right now. In Wimmo Harbor, where the South Carolina Yacht Club is, 45 homes sold, one is listed for sale, six villas sold, and there are no, um, no villas available. In Wexford, 43 homes sold, and there's one listed for sale right now, and they don't have any villas. So that gives you, I think, a pretty good indication of uh, the demand that's out there that was uh, fulfilled really the past two years and um, the fact that we are a little bit low or a lot low on inventory right now. So this is how we're starting the year. Uh, we'll see what the next um, 10 to 12 months bring. I look forward to working with you. Look forward to your questions. Welcome uh, any feedback, comments, questions at any point in time. Um, stay safe, healthy, and see you soon. Bye.